So, what did Darren get Diamond? Is it the Assault Rifles? Nah. Is it the Subs? Nah. Is it the Attack Rifles? Kinda thought the Snipers would be the third tab to be honest. Is it the Snipers? You bet your little dick that it isn't! Yes, fucking gold Barrett. Don't panic, Darren. Come on, you need one more kill. You need one more fucking kill. Come on. Don't panic, Mr. Manry! How much more do you have left, Darren? I'll tell you in a sec. I'm running away. Bad man, you're good, you're good. Yeah! Uh, I have Hot to go shower. Pennington. Okay, no, no, never mind, I'm joking. It is. Because everyone who subscribed here has a big dick. Oh, wh what, you don't? No, you do. Speaking of dicks, this gun. The apparent 50 cal of the game. This gun is a dick. It can suck a dick. It can get fucked by a dick. That being said, it wasn't all that bad. Like, when you got used to it, when you got the Tiger Team barrel for it, it got a bit more consistent. And when you got used to the flow of the gun and everything like that, but overall, piece of shit dick. I'm gonna play Sniper's only mosh pit just cause I kinda actually wanna get a gameplay with the sniper in general. I'm not playing very well lately, so normal multiplayer will will just not fucking work. See? Diamond snipers. Oh this game's almost over. Fuck. This fucking game is almost over as well. Fuck it, we're running with it. So my transgender dyslexic friend, uh, Keen, <laughs> gave me a challenge throughout the month of February to upload as much as possible, if not every day. I think his challenge was actually every day, but like, fuck that. I don't know if you saw my video at the start of the year, or the start of 2020, I think it was. But um, I kind of said I wasn't uploading unless... I had a video that I was completely okay with and uh, that I actually wanted to upload in the first place. Like this this video was kind of obvious that I'm going to post it because Diamond Snipers is always the first things I go for and the fact that I have it, you know, you have to have to make a video on it, it's just fucking what I do. Like, Even if my shot isn't actually, you know, on. But yeah, all throughout February, like, yeah, yeah, that's not happening, Chief. So, like, the main reason why I don't upload daily is just because I rather quant... No, the other way around. So the main reason why I actually never have uploaded daily is I rather quality over quantity. Just simply because they're better to watch and they're better to look back on. And I rather have an... I'd rather be known for putting time and effort into this than just fucking uploading for the sake of uploading. And I, I know consistency is key and all that, but like, uh, like, I, 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 for these- Hot scoping bastard boy, fuck you, mother, fuck you, mother. Jesus Christ, Kyle, alright, calm your fucking self. I'm trying to talk here, I'm trying to do a fucking commentary. So like, for me personally, I no longer watch those YouTubers who upload every day. Well, not really. Depending on the content, like, let's say, Syndicate's vlogs, or Jev uploading every day, or every, every day when he can. I watched them. Oh, how did I miss that? Oh, I'm really shit today. Oh, I'm really shit today. Holy fuck, yeah. Okay. Just because I like them as a person, I like their personalities, is the reason why people watch Jev. He's pretty much loved by all the Call of Duty community who actually knows of him. So for that reason, I rather a structured video, a long structured video of maybe funny moments or something like that. Seeing as though people don't know me that much, they want to see just funny moments and sit down, relax, have a, have, maybe have a laugh. They're the videos I like to produce. And they take a long time to edit. And for those who don't edit properly, for those who just snip up a segment of video, maybe put a, a long backing track behind it and just leave it, don't touch it at all, 
stuff like that and just put a little webcam in the corner fair enough you do you that's not for me that takes maybe 10 minutes to, uh, to edit depending on the content obviously it could take from 10 minutes to an hour for me an edit could take a week a small cook on like this could take a couple of days depending on what i want on it depending on what comes of it depending on what sort of a mood i'm in if i want to edit or not it can be a task so what i'm going to do is i'm going to purposely try and sit down and do this edit in one sitting i'm going to have it up on the screen now probably uh how long it took and uh, judge for yourselves what you're thinking if the time is justified you know you know this is just to educate you as well as to why i'm not doing this and keen if you're watching this is a bit of a cop out i did call you a transgender dyslexic man but uh i'm not i haven't told a lie in this video at all have i <laughs> but yeah no flumps for me at the end of the day i was offered a box of flumps and if you don't know what they are just you know they're on the screen but you know i'm not getting them anymore right? Oh, it just collided me with a fucking Barrett. I will admit, that 50 cal was the worst gun to try and get gold. As regards snipers, obviously they're worst guns to try and get gold. But when you got used to it, when you ended up getting the ti Tiger Team Barrel, like I said, it wasn't that bad when you got used to the swing of the, the skull and aiming high and, you know, when you got into a consistent rhythm of actually using the gun. Just like every other sniper really, this game, sniping wise, is different to other CODs. It feels weird, it's obviously, I didn't have the long, or the, the quickest scoping snipers. I could have had them a bit quicker. I personally just couldn't make it the way I liked it, where they were the quickest scopes. Or scoping times on guns and stuff like that. So, you know, my personal preference was the classes on the screen now for the Thunder, for example. And I loved it, actually. This Thunder was the gun I played the best with out of any sniper. Some people say the Pennington's the best because it's the quickest. I personally agree with that, and I do like the Pennington, but the Thunder for me was just way more consistent. Even with that little few milliseconds of speed, or less speed, should I say, it definitely won the battle of the best sniper for me in this game. Snipers in this game, they're just too sluggish. They're too slow, um, sluggish, slow, kind of the same thing voice crack but overall i like the sniping in this game i'm not gonna lie like it's been a kind of a breath of fresh air for a treyarch game to have good sniping black ops 4 wasn't that good for me it wasn't good to me at all uh didn't uh you know for those who were around you know what i thought of black ops 4 in the end and the sniping was not a good part of that The only thing I hate about the sniper in this game is the kill feed is way too fast to get feeds. So I would definitely take that into consideration if I was to, let's say, rate the rate the sniper in general. Sorry, I was on a bit of a streak there. Just wanted to make this quick video to mark the start of a bit of an upload schedule <laughs> for the month, maybe. I'm not going to upload every day. I'm just not. So, yeah. Uh, expect a couple more videos than usual this month, hopefully, hopefully, as I get a collateral in the kill cam. Look, 